There's been a couple different reports out there yesterday about the Bucks. Yeah. Um, one of them even said <coughs> that the Bucks are sold pending uh, league approval. Um, I guess can you clear any of that up? No, that's uh, that's not so. I uh, it's an ongoing process. I I said uh, back in December that I was looking for additional people to come in as investors, owners, and that I wanted to strengthen ownership. Also, that we needed to get to a new facility. The two are really one and the same because we can't stay in Wisconsin unless we get a new facility. So we need to do both. We need to strengthen ownership. We need to get to a new facility. And I retained a very uh, outstanding firm in New York, Allen and Company, to work with me on the project. And it's an ongoing process. Nothing has been finalized. Um, you know, I, I don't know how it's going to turn out exactly, but I'm very um, encouraged by how it's gone so far. And I'm looking forward to a positive result. Can you touch on it all or can you say at all how close, how close a, an impending sale might be at this point? Well, it's hard to know. You know, I, deals are never deals until they're over. As they say, nothing's agreed until everything's agreed. So I, I couldn't predict when a deal might be consummated. I can only say that the, you know, they and I are working hard along with the NBA league office, the commissioner, Adam Silver, and uh, we've made good progress but there's nothing to report in terms of a deal being reached. Are you encouraged by the, by the progress? Or? Yes, I am encouraged by the progress so far. There are significant numbers of people that are interested. So, you know, I'm hopeful that things are going to turn out well, that the Bucks will remain in Wisconsin, we'll get to a new facility, and, um, you know, we'll have another generation of NBA basketball uh, and entertainment for the people of our state.